Queen's Gambit accepted, Central Variation, McDonnell Defense, 4.NF3BB4+. Smooth one player took the advantage and never let go. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. The players battled pretty evently in the end game. Opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. D5 establishes a presence in the center, controls the e4 square, and opens up the light squared bishop. The queen's gambit offers up a wing pawn to attack the center and distract black from the e4 square. The queen's gambit accepted immediately captures the c4 pawn and forces white to prove an advantage with one less pawn. e4 takes full control of the center and allows the light squared bishop to attack the pawn on c4. e5 takes space in the center, attacks the d4 pawn and allows the dark squared bishop to develop. nf3 develops the knight toward the center, attacks the e5 pawn and defends the d4 pawn. bb4 plus gives a check and develops the bishop. This blocks the check from an opposing bishop. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is the last book move. This is an equal trade. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This wins a tempo by threatening a knight and forcing it to move away. It is best. This defends the attacked knight. It is excellent. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This exposes an attack, threatening a bishop. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. This captures a vulnerable pawn. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. Takes back. This threatens to take an open file with a rook. It is best. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is excellent. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This defends a knight that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. The rooks are coordinated and powerfully doubled on the file. It is best. This challenges the opposing rook for control of the open file. It is excellent. This is an equal trade. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. This is the start of the end game and white is equal. It is excellent. That's not a mistake but it's not the best move either. It is good. This activates the king in the end game by getting it off of the back rank. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. An active king is critical in the end game and getting it off of the back rank is the first step. It is good. This is a fair move. It is good. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. Right on target. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. That's fine. It is good. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This evades the check from the knight. It is good. This misses a better way to move a knight to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is best. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This allows the opponent to capture the checking knight. It is an inaccuracy. This is an equal trade. 
This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. This evades the check from the knight. It is good. This defends the attacked knight. It is good. Very precise. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This threatens to fork pieces. It is an inaccuracy. This threatens to fork pieces. It is a mistake. The game is still close to equal, but white lost their advantage. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. Right on target. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. This move puts the pawn on a safer square. This threatens to take an outpost with the knight. It is best. White was better off, but now their position is winning. It is a mistake. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This gives away a free pawn. It is an inaccuracy. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. This threatens to fork pieces. It is excellent. This stops the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is excellent. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is excellent. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This makes a passed pawn, meaning no opposing pawn can challenge it on its way to promotion. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is excellent. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a mistake. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This allows the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a mistake. This overlooks an opportunity to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This permits the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is an inaccuracy. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This pushes a passed pawn. This is the only move that works. This prevents the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a great move. Smooth one player took the advantage and never let go. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. The players battled pretty evently in the end game.